Welcome back. This is Yamma Jack. Today we're gonna do some. Uh, nah, I don't know. I don't know, man. Let's try. Uh... Zed landing on Hell on Earth. Sure. That sounds like fun. Hell on Earth is going pretty well so far. Still, like I said, we don't have, uh, I don't know how many episodes I've actually recorded and going to be saving, but uh, we don't have a uh, super high success rate with it. I have had to delete several episodes as well that just didn't even make it. It's like wave two. Um, but so far it's, okay, we're just going to do a little bit of a spray into that. Don't need to be accurate, you just gotta kill stuff. Where's this other dude? I saw it, there's a dude coming around the mountain here, right? Yeah! Coming around the mountain, here he comes! They're talking in the uh, in the Discord I'm in about uh, like skirt length and stuff. I'm like I, just... I don't, I don't, I don't know. It, it, it's a strange thing to be talking about to me because like the the length of your skirt doesn't really say anything. People get preferences and whatnot, but to me, I, I just I don't care. If your skirt's two inches or above the knees or wh wh who who cares? You do you, fam. Anyway, they 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 were uh, they were talking about it and they're like, yeah, anything above the knees, it's too short. I'm like, look down. <laughs> huh. I'm currently wearing a. Uh, your gown that's a little bit above the knees. Is that really a thing? Really? That's cool. So can they like move or something? That's really cool. Are there like more than like 10 or whatever it is? Is there 11 on the... That's cool. Okay, yeah, yeah. This is all fun and dandy and, and, and all that, yeah. Let's pop that. I really would like to survive this run, though. Would It would be a, a great thing to do, you know? Not sure if we'll be able to make that happen, because... Uh, yeah, I feel like they're in different places. Can't even shoot. Yeah, like there's one up there. Does it change depending on the difficulty you're on? Or did they like change it or something? Should be one right down here. Okay, we're just gonna have to book it down here. Yeah, there's still one right here, so like... Clearly they didn't change much. Huh. I didn't know there was... So there should be one right up here, right? On the ground? Unless we already got this one. No, it's right here. And then one on the... Uh, right there. Should be one right over here. Yeah. Huh. There's like multiple different... That's really cool. Please, no. Ooh, yeah. 
give me that little bit of extra dodge. I think we're gonna have to use it to take some of these guys out as well, because uh, I don't really want to go with the uh, the pistol. You are a problem, okay? Hold up, because how many are there then? Because there's one in here. Is there another one over here somewhere like that? Like, kind of chilling out on, like this rock maybe. I wanna, I wanna find them all. You're gonna, you're gonna be left alive, okay? You get to, you get to survive for a little bit. Okay, so I know there's one in here. Right there, yeah, it's still there. So have I hit them all already? Have I hit 10? Because it's not giving me the notification anymore. So there's still, there's just more than you need. Wow. Should be one right here, right? I already got that one. I might have already got that one. So there's just m more than 10. And you only need to hit 10 for whatever it is that it does when you hit 10. I have no clue. That's cool. We're also talking about chainmail. I had this, uh, I used to work at Tim Hortons way back in the day. And uh, there's this guy near where I live who makes uh, chainmail armor and he came through the drive through once wearing full chainmail and uh, it's, it's, it's something I never thought I'd see honestly working at uh, Tim Hortons working at any kind of drive through you get so many uh, unusual people coming through you know like uh, one time we had um, this basket of puppies come through the drive-thru. Somebody's, uh, somebody's dog just gave birth and they had like this basket of some kind of puppy. I forget what um, breed, but uh, it was uh, some breed or another of, uh, of like a dozen puppies just chilling out in a basket in their uh, passenger seat. It's the, uh, the most adorable thing. Um, you have a lot of people come through that I guess are like trying to do pranks on you or something like that. And I'm just like, I don't care. You know, for, for the most part, pranks on drive through people don't really bother me personally. That's not where I want that to go. I thought it would bounce. For the most part, it doesn't really bother me. You know, it'll be people coming through and asking for something that's like not there, and I'm like, yeah, haha, very funny. We did the same thing a billion other people have done. But sometimes they try to do like, I don't know, I guess they're recording my reaction to it or something, and they're coming through like half naked and, and all that, and I'm like, I just take your coffee and leave. I just do not care. Um, but the basket of puppies was a was a very cute one. Uh, let's see, we used to have this one lady who would come through and get. Um, I'm glad I don't have like any kind of working working at a, a fast food joint. You don't have any kind of like uh, confidentiality agreement with your uh, your clients. You know, there is nothing like that. So uh, I get to talk about them and not have to worry about being sued. Oh my god, I hate Edars so much. I hate Edars. What did I just say? Um, so I get I get to talk about you know the people who came through the drive-thru and um, not worry about getting sued. But there's one lady who come through. She'd get a uh, it was like a medium French vanilla with like seven sweetener and two sugar shots in it. <laughs> wow, that's uh, unbelievably, unbelievably sweet. Like normally when somebody comes through and they get something just bizarre, I'll, I'll get it. You know, like when when I'm on break or something like that. Like I'll just, I'll just get it. You know, try it. You know, if they like it, maybe it's good, right? 
good enough for them, it's good enough for me. That's one that I have not tried, and I, I don't plan on trying. Because, uh, <laughs> that's, that's too far. <laughs> that's too much. But, like, it's just unbelievably sweet. Okay, we're going to run, like, this way. Toss a nade back there like that. Hopefully it gets some kills. Oh. The hell on earth kind of thing is honestly just not like like this is what I'm saying, right? It's not like totally something that I can do confidently. You know, like when I'm off camera and I'm not focusing on recording, I do a bit better than I'm doing right now. Marginally. You know, not having to worry about recording and talking and all of that. It makes it makes a difference. Uh, a marked difference to the uh, performance that I can uh, put out, of course, yes. Oh my god. I don't have any grenades. That's why I'm not throwing grenades. I see. I'm trying to toss out grenades and uh, they're just not happening. I'm like, why aren't, why aren't I able to throw grenades? I don't have any. I have one now, but... Thought I had, uh, I thought I had filled them up. I guess I hadn't yet. Hadn't quite got the money for it. We're going this way. I like camping up, um... Oh, no. No! Ah, oh, she exploded my nade. I was hoping I'd be able to get it just outside her, uh, her reach. Ah! Why can't I bounce a nade the right way, you know? Come on, me. How pathetic can you be? This one's up top. He's coming down. Oh my god. This is too many flesh pounds. Like, what on earth? And a... Oh, not a stalker. What am I stuck on right now? Oh my god, the stalkers. Oh! <laughs> I hate stalkers! I hate them! <laughs> I hate stalkers! <sighs> okay, that's gonna do it for today. Thank you for watching. Remember to like the video if you like it. Subscribe to see more in the future. Comment if you have anything to say. And I will see you next time. Bye bye!